When our village was attacked, I hid inside my house because I couldn't flee due to my disability. My husband left with three of our eight children to hide in the bush, and the attackers killed them. Monica is one of over 500,000 people internally displaced by conflict in the Central African Republic. People with disabilities are often left behind and struggle to flee to safety. I wasn't able to flee like the others because I have a disability. I couldn't find my crutches. I stayed and protected my child until the gunfire stopped. Those who make it to displacement camps have trouble accessing basic services. When they distribute rations, even when we are on the register, we are unable to receive our food because the crowd is too tight and we can't move forward. The sanitary conditions in the camps are not suitable and several people told us how they had to suffer the indignity of crawling on their hands. To go to the bathroom, I have to crawl. I have to leave my wheelchair before entering the bush. My daughter has to clean the feces off my dress. Fighting is getting worse in the east of the country, and that's all the more reason to pay attention to those in urgent need as they make it to the displacement camps. Governments should step up and ensure that the humanitarian response is funded, and UN and aid agencies should do everything they can to ensure that people with disabilities have access to decent sanitation and food.